Good afternoon, and thank you for allowing me to introduce our next recipient. Um, first of all, what an honor to be here and uh, introduce my dad. Uh, just seeing all the legendary names having grown up in the state of Georgia and finally putting uh, the people to the, to the names, uh, Coach Winslet, Coach, uh, I'm sorry, Coach Lamb, it's just an amazing honor to be up here to present this award. I want to thank God for everyone's health and well-being and attendance today. I want to thank you, Georgia Coaches, Georgia Athletic Coaches Association, for this honor for my dad, Coach William Buck Godfrey. And also, thanks to his top assistant coach, through their journey of, for 45 years, Ms. Joyce Elaine Godfrey. Um, when I was asked by my dad to uh, introduce him, you know, he, he, he asked me in a subtle way because I'm, you know, kind of laid back when it comes to speaking in front of people and things like that. But I told him I'd be truly honored to, to present this award to him. And uh, there were tons of ways I could have gone with this presentation, but I wanted to encapsulate what he has meant to the entire community of South DeKalb. Uh, not only to Southwest DeKalb High School, but to Gordon, Towers, Worthington Valley Swimming, as well as many other supporting roles he has helped to spring that drive, desire, and will to succeed. Over the tenure of 39 years, I'm convinced it was not all about winning on the gridiron, the diamond, or pool, but how we as kids would grow and evolve to manhood and womanhood as responsible adults for our own families and community. It was definitely more than victories. And I asked him earlier today when we were at the hotel, I said, uh, Dad, did you ever think it would come to this? And he simply said, no, um, I, I wasn't in it for winning or all this, it was about the kids. And his mentor, Coach Eddie Robinson, once told him, Coach, if you love them, coach them and let somebody else count the victories. And that's something that he's held on to. What was instilled was character, self-pride, discipline, respecting others, loyalty, and the list goes on. However, winning would become a byproduct of doing things the right way. I remember asking him on several occasions about college coaching opportunities, and he clearly stated that his job was to bridge the gap for high school kids to college so we would be successful academically, then athletically. He wanted us to think big and beyond, take chances, not to be afraid, and to play the hand that's been dealt. No excuse making. The last thing from a personal note, despite the grind of being one of the most successful coaches in one of the most demanding states being Georgia, he has always been a husband and dad first to my mother, myself, and my sister Rashawn. To us, he is simply daddy. Always had and made the time. With that, I present to you my best friend, my dad. Coach William Buck Godfrey. 